Welcome to UCS. We are so excited to have you on campus this fall. Your check-in process begins even before you arrive on campus. Review the move-in section of the UCF Housing and Residence Life website for COVID-19 testing information, driving directions, unloading zones and long-term parking, and room setup. Fall move-in begins Saturday, August 8th and continues through Sunday, August 23rd and is by appointment only. You must register online for your COVID-19 test before you arrive on campus. Your registration will request personal information, including your insurance and UCF ID number. Be sure to enter your UCF ID and not your NID. Valencia students should enter your VID in this field. Your COVID testing time is your move-in time, as shown on this chart. Be sure to review all check-in information on our move-in day webpage, including the move-in map. This map will be a great resource for driving and walking directions. On move-in day, you will want to dress comfortably, stay hydrated, and plan for the heat and possible rainstorms. Review our packing list and make sure you have your ID before you leave home. When you arrive on campus, your first stop will be for a COVID-19 test in Garage A. If you and your helpers are driving to campus in more than one vehicle, only the vehicle with the resident needs to proceed to drive through testing and check-in. Additional vehicles should go directly to the appropriate unloading zone and wait there for your student to rejoin you. If you are coming to campus with one vehicle, but it exceeds the seven foot clearance, you will be directed to oversized parking and will need to use pedestrian COVID-19 testing and check-in. Plan for longer wait times. Upon arrival, you will drive up to Andromeda Loop for your COVID-19 test. Your photo ID will be required at the first check-in with Adventist Bio Labs for testing. You may not go to the housing check-in until after you complete your COVID test. Once your COVID-19 test is complete, you will drive from garage A to garage C for housing check-in. Have a photo ID ready to show at check-in. If you are picking up your UCF ID at check-in, you still need to bring another form of photo ID. A driver's license, state ID card, or passport will do the job. To speed up your check-in, bring a screenshot of your room assignment screen from the housing portal. The image should include your HRL ID and room assignment. You should have this ready to show on your phone or other mobile device. It should look something like this. Do not bring any more than two individuals with you to assist with moving. After you have checked in, you will drive to the designated unloading zone for your community. Parking and unloading areas are not near the residence halls, so we recommend that families bring their own hand cart or dolly to transport items from vehicles. Do not park in fire lanes, service vehicle parking or reserved parking at any time during move-in. Use your mobile device or bring a printed map to find your assigned building. You will need a photo ID to check out a rolling bin. These items are cleaned between each trip, but still use at your own risk. Once your vehicle is done unloading, it must be moved to long-term parking by end of day. Overnight parking is not permitted in unloading zones until move-in is over on August 23rd. Once you are all moved in, be sure to wear your mask in all shared or public spaces, minimize interactions with others, avoid groups as much as possible, and maintain appropriate physical distance. Until you receive your test results, it is best to get takeout or cook in your own space. Avoid eating in restaurants or dining halls. Your resident assistant will be contacting you online. You will have several virtual welcome events to take part in and will need to attend your mandatory virtual community meeting. Even while staying physically distant, we're here to help you connect. Be sure to reach out to your community staff by phone or online. We want to help make your UCF experience a memorable one. 